Hello again. So, of all the scenarios, this is the this is by far my favorite, and um, well, the one I've actually run the most times. Um, I know the puzzle locations the most, but I've never actually done slash beaten it on very hard. Mostly because even if combat's irrelevant, it's um. Well, I know on hard it was already a huge, uh, huge ramp up in terms of um, kind of the weird poison air thing they've got going on. So, first things first, uh, what is your... It's, I don't know what his alternate types are, so I'm just going to go check out some of those. Oh, I know Ben. Look at who the hell Philip is. Alright, um... He might yes. open up his locker, and... Who should number three be? Should probably be one of you, so you can open up the extra little thingies. There we go, we're in the story anyway. Not very hard, infinity, nightmare. Um, usual type stuff for this little experiment here, which again, the whole point is to see. Um, if somebody's doing this blind, like, I have a very vague idea of what the puzzles are. Um, I know roughly where they might be. Um, largely just based off of other stuff. Okay. Good, we got a helper right off the bat. Now, the plumber type of characters. They come with a knife, and they come with a sort of leg breaker move, which I believe... let's see... Those are unlimited. Okay, so she, he kind of comes with infinite ammo. Now, that item on the left is one of the items that, in all the other scenarios, that thing on the left. Oh crap, time run, time run. So this is the thing that makes this scenario a problem. Like on easy and normal, that's manageable. I can't aim these wrenches worth of crap today. Yeah, his wrenches are just basically a straight-up leg breaker. Um, yeah, the thing is, as you're walking around, you're in a situation where there's constant gas coming out of different places, and you only have... You only have a few, um canisters to actually neutralize them all. Now, on hard, they were already pretty rare. On normal, you at least get one for every room. On easy, they're just all over the dang place. So I'm assuming they're just gonna be nigh on non-existent in this one. I wanna get rid of her before she causes problems for me. <laughs> These are hilarious. Their function is basically the same as a magnum, except it's for the kneecaps. So in many ways it's better than having a gun. Um memo flavor text. There should be a special item around here. Super pixel perfect on those. those. Also I find that on emulation this seems to run better than a lot of the other scenarios. Alright. Combination safe. Last time it needed to be. Uh, that thing had a file to trade for a guy for one of the plates, so I'm assuming it'll probably be the same here. He's got specific, uh, knife combos. Um, unfortunately, because, you know, it's a PS2 game and timing is a strange thing, um, he actually, it's, you're gonna end up having a better time just freaking swinging the thing. Here, uh, I need one to hmm. okay, open the damn thing, on. Use my tools to open this door. <laughs> Help me. Come on. I don't think this room's getting overwhelmed. 
Maybe this hurts more? I don't know. Door's stupidly tough. Come on. <laughs> oh, that's just hilarious. Prison door. Maybe I should have gone with Magnum guy. I know there's stuff on the other side of this door, and I'm pretty sure one of the plates is going to be there because it was on hard. So, okay, the plates that I'm talking about. Oh, cool, oh, they're going to open it for me. So, the plates that I'm talking about. The, um,. There's basically five plates that you need to get in order to get to the second half of this scenario. As per usual, it just comes in multiple parts. Mm. Oh man, these things are hilarious. Weird wrench ninja. But whatever. Okay. Do some stuff in the middle, guys. Stay that. No, let me in. Yeah, these feel a lot more frequent than they were in the last one. Good. Wait. Push this out of the way, cause I, I know in some scenarios there's a shotgun in there. Let me in. Caution. Oh, sorry. Warning. Caution. Warning. Uh, this is... yeah, no. Holy oh, hell, you've got to be kidding me. If you're wanting a lore explanation for all of that crap, uh, basically they have this sort of weird security system in which they shove nerve gas at anyone that's uh, currently in the building. Yeah, you know what? Turns out that's a really stupid security system. Who'd have thunk it? Need that herb, otherwise I wouldn't be bothering with this fight. If you're wondering why I keep popping these random herbs, they give you temporary immunity to the virus going up. I don't think I can aim up. Okay. This kind of looks like the guy from uh, GTA. A Vice City, I mean. It would be nice to look ahead of me right now. They're like, if they did this game with kind of similar maps and slightly better puzzles, uh, with, um, kind of the modern RE4S controls, man, that would have been really something. Kind of sad that this is the closest we got to that thing being accomplished. Through it. Get this nerve gas thing. Right, cool. So I guess it's in two rooms at once. That's new. I want to say... Oh, hell no. I want to say the, um, normal and hard versions... Oh, I'm just gonna die here in a sec if this keeps up. Oh, can I go this way? No, it's locked in. Okay, I'll have to go around. Over here! No, I have my thumbsticks mapped wrong, I think, because the, um, vocal commands don't seem to do what they should do. I'll have to go around to the other side. I need to get to that other side in order to get a code. In order to use that code on the safe. I'm assuming the file's still in there. Oh, crap. Right. Time to die, then. Go out 
to her, please. Thank you, Rita. Okay, he just died. Doesn't have anything I need, so we'll just move on. Um, also, if you're not playing on Nightmare, yeah, they're a lot more durable. Uh, they can just tank hits for days, and it's actually a little bit hilarious. Because they will do so all the time. Like, the AI will just run up and take hits for you. And that's about all they can be good for in some cases. Okay. Herb, I'll take it. Apparently that full heal wasn't a full heal. The bullets, don't need them. Awesome. I love breaking doors. Game design. <laughs> yeah. Just changing this alone will improve this game so much. This is literally just whatever. It doesn't matter if you're kicking, pushing, whatever else. Literally just whatever damage that particular attack does, and these wrenches seem to do a lot, so this should be doing a lot. You've got, got their hunting rifle, it's just basically a skeleton key. Oh, that only took a million tries. So I think the way the gas works in the other versions is probably like every other room is uh, what ends up getting triggered. And it feels like in this one, maybe it's just two rooms right next to each other, and that's how they up. Warning. Caution. Warning. Good. Okay, good. That was one of the plates. Away. 60% dead. Haven't even gotten all the plates yet. I don't know this one. Don't contain anything useful. has something in it. Useless. Get that other herb. Diamonds. Yeah, no. No point in coming to this room. The thing, it almost feels like they made it very hard to the point where you actually need to surgically prepare what you're doing with all your peoples. Immune, shut up. There's a breakable door. I deal with that breakable door right now, though. I'm gonna have to go back there later anyway, so hopefully there's not any plot important items. she didn't just die there. And here's that one where you find uh, Brad and AC2. It's only a full heal if you actually get all of them in there now. I don't know. I don't know what the changes are. Reload or something? Oh, yeah, she's not surviving. Not that that's anything new, really. Oh, I think this is one of two rooms that can't get poisoned. That thing. He's in here. 
That thing I was pushing earlier in the right place. That was basically a box that's up here. Like, like I said, this is the one that I know the most, so I at least know the layout of everything. Um, just because on normal and easy and stuff like that, it's actually a really fun scenario. This is the first half, you're just kind of going around collecting all the bits of this puzzle. Shotgun rooms? No. And down here, just pistol rounds. Uh, that's the safe key, I believe. Well, this is just dumb. Can they just make you run the entire way around again? That's really the puzzle. Okay, that's safe. That's on the other side here. Basically, the idea is, yeah, you take that key, you open up the safe. Because there's two weird keys that don't exactly say what they do. And by the way, if you're thinking, hey, why is that the kind of key that goes in the safe? It absolutely isn't, but somebody decided that's the way first. I think it even says, like, hey, there's a dial pad on here. Hmm, I'm gonna use a key on it. So there's that. I don't know if there's any items on the other side, but... Honestly, given how scarce they've been so far, I don't even want to check. Items here, yeah. Almost all the items are seemingly gone. Get that in temporary immunity. Every other scenario, this is where you find the codes. So, 49. Ooh, finally a gun. Hey! And recovery meds. Actually, I'll leave that for you to take. Good, you're gonna go over here. And you're gonna open this thing like a friggin' champion. What was that? Why did I think there was a thing for her? Here, open it. Open go! It. No! Go! 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 Yes! <laughs> there you go. Oh, okay. Well, never mind. So much for that. Um, she apparently doesn't want to take her recovery medicine either. Get this thing. Take it and bump. Actually, no. You know who this guy looks like? Uh, looks like the guy from Deadly Premonitions. Just be able to go this way. Okay, I'm gonna assume one of the plates is in the safe. That's like a fancy gun and the other difficulties as far as I recall. Alright, cool. This is lucky. I'm gonna assume it's there. Um. Huh. Oh, God bless you. I'm the one sneezed. Go. Smacked. Yeah, this, is, this feels weird. I don't think I'm even going to use the pistol. It feels way better. Uh, 6249, right? I think. These wrenches are going to be way more effective. And I just move on and see if this is what I think it is. And then that would leave two possible locations for the last one, if this is how it goes. Um, because there's one item... Okay, you trade one item for another item. Lost bird. I think birds in the game. Mostly because there's so little you can actually do against them. Okay, got uh, had to take a little bit of a break there. Sounds like it's coming from somewhere else, so that's fine. She's still alive. Now. 
There's an A right on it. Okay. Cool, because this is how safes work. Hey! Excuse me. Okay, got the ruby plate. Yeah, because normally your third AI guy for your secondary AI guy is um is the one that has the final plate. So let's see, that leaves one to be traded for that file. Picked up the file, right? Okay. Um, I doubt it's on the roof, is there's been no precedent for that in other difficulties. Um do the unicorn metal thing maybe. Oh crap, it's in the dog kennel, isn't it? I think it's in the dog kennel. Luckily, it's one of the things that the wrenches are super good against. <laughs> Funny, the Maggie guys, yeah, arguably much worse than this guy with his freaking wrenches. Um. Uh, er, er. Jokes. Caution. Warning. Caution. Warning. Yeah, they could give you more than like a two second warning to actually get to a door. That'd be nice one. Mm. <laughs> Let me go put I'm gonna go put this plate in there because then if it I figure I'm gonna go trade that file anyway. Because there's a door on every other scenario so far, it's been a breakable door. Um, but it, but there's a key that uh, cop guy gets. You know what? I'm gonna go in that direction. Up one of these. Just dead. Fastest way, I think. They're basically down the same hallway. Might as well. Mm, no, that's presumptive that I'll actually make it that far. I was gonna say, let me go mix up some herbs and leave them lying around, but A, that's presumptive. B, the AI might eat them. Funny, because you can hit these guys, but they're invincible. Okay, 80% dead, so I'm gonna have to start the end scenario right, at, uh, right when it happens. Exit. Oh, here's the hole. Completely out of time already. I'm gonna say the odds of winning this. Oh, sh. Oh, stupid. Ha 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 ha. Freaking hilarious. Um. There's a. Possibly. I love so many ideas of this game. That is not one of them. I mean, personally, I think whoever came up with stuff like that probably. <laughs> Would be nice to have a set up a speed up button for this. It takes like 30 magnums or so to break through this thing. I'm not for having strong doors, but uh, they're ridiculous. Caution. Warning. Really? Caution. Warning. It's okay, it can't get through these bars for some reason. Because then you get to this part and everything's fine and dandy. This is one of the ones that can't be gassed. Great, got another 12% out of that. Let's take your file. Uh, what do you give me? Alright. Wait, hopefully this is done now. They expect you to friggin' kick this door down. This is 
zombie got cast out of here. Actually, I think it partially deletes them in under some circumstances. Please. Finally. Okay. Now to die by dogs. Seven percent, so basically never getting hit for the final part of the scenario. Might actually manage to beat one of these. Fifty of these guys with like just wrenches. Perfect. Oh, where did I leave that pistol? That office. Would risk getting gas to go there. I think I might have to try though. I'm gonna be relying if provided the snare gets that far, I'm gonna be relying on these gas canisters. Right, 94%. Through here. Good about picking it up. And forget that. Alright, doing this with wrenches if it's happening at all. Hey, Reed has got a pistol, mate. He'll use it well. Yeah, there's pretty much no way. It, can't, it just ticks up way too fast. Back, down, back after a little break. So. Yeah. I suppose I should mention that, yeah, this was in no way designed Wait. to be soloable like this. Oh, there's a green herb up there. Let's stop it for a little bit. And go grab the herbs over here. And just gonna, I guess, attempt to kite everybody around. He gets munched. Hmm. There we go. Listen Get the cutscene. Everybody else is dead. Thumbs on the way. Get to the front lobby. He's looking around. None of the other people that were holding out out front actually made it. Now we wait for a sec. Triggers. And it thinks we're this guy. And then they break through. Out of nowhere. Into that exact spot where he was just standing. Let's pretend this was physically possible. <laughs> he's dead. Okay, he's dead, isn't he? Okay, I think their AI might be a little bit broken here. 
broken here. Double hit. Okay, yeah, no, this is fine. This is the fire scouter I'm worried about now, then. Super close, though. Uh, there you go. Potentially very doable. Um, on a semi-blind kind of thing. Just, um... Failed right at the end there. Kinda happy with that, how that went. 